What is up YouTube? In this video I want to talk about my first impressions of the Altar Rivera. If you want to help this channel out please feel free to subscribe and like this video. It really goes a long way and I would really appreciate it. This is the first generation Rivera model. It's a medium cushioned road running shoe. I have a sneaking suspicion that they're going to try to replace the Torrin as we know it because they have a similar stack height with 26 millimeters and they are slightly more bouncy just like the Escalante. Right off the bat you can see that they are more narrow than we know from most ultra shoes and I don't think they'll be releasing a wide version either. They are quite well padded and quite firm, firmer than the Escalante. It has more exposed midsole rubber than the Torin or the Torin Plush making it lighter but probably also more prone to wear out quite quickly. It's good to see they've added an extra hole for the runner's knot and the laces aren't ridiculously long as we usually see in other ultra models. At 130 euros, it makes them one of the cheapest ultra shoes around. I always thought ultra was pretty expensive. I have the impression they're going for something more flashy and, remind, and they really remind me of uh, other mainstream brands out there. Kind of a shame because I always thought ultra was more of an alternative brand. You always see shoes like this at the gym. They're quite bendy like the Escalante. I felt my feet were getting quite warm on my first run. After about 10k on the treadmill I noticed that my feet would swell up a little bit, getting a little bit more snug around this area. So I actually want to try them out outside but it's not possible right now because of well this. So I tried them out on the treadmill instead, ran around uh, 14k in them to just try them out. Um, I'll give them a few more runs before I come with my final verdict. They have the same Ultra Ego midsole as the Escalante, making them nice and bouncy. I think they're gonna uh, replace the Torrent as we know it with the, with the Rivera, and I have the impression that the Torrent Plush will be the new Torrent, but that's just a sneaking suspicion that I have. They're slightly lighter than the Torrent, and that's probably because there's less outer sole down here, making it lighter. But of course that'll make it prone to wearing out quicker. The tongue is quite thick and plush. Don't know why it needs to be so thick. Seems like too much material to me. The heel cup has more of a V shape. The inner sole has more of a cup form as you can see. I think what I want to go for this is, is cater to a large audience. So try, try to get more mainstream. For 130 euros, they're probably more attractive to get for most recreational joggers out there. So those were my first thoughts of the Otto Rivera. <laughs> Let me know if I missed anything or if you're planning on getting them. Thank you again for watching and see you next time. Bye.